Hi, this is Nolan from Benchmark, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to use the Setup Anywhere feature. So David recently had a customer who was looking to emulate the Leica Setup Anywhere feature with his total station, and where you can shoot two points, rotate those two points to a direction, and voila, you've set up your total station. So what I've done is I've created a point here on 10,000, 10,000, 10,000, which I'm going to occupy with my total station here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on select mode and then go back site by one point or direction. For my occupy point, as I said, I wanna be on point one and I'm gonna say I have a 1.5 meter instrument height. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna say a back site direction of zero degrees. You're gonna see I now have a line going at zero degrees. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to shoot a point here um, that is going to be the corner of my first um, direction that I want to be shooting. So I'm going to hit accept here. That's going to store the first point. And I'm going to say yes, store the observed point at the back side here and just save it. So you can see here I have point one where the total station is and I've just shot point two. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot point number three here, which is going to be the second part of my setup here. So what I'm going to do now is obviously aim my total station at this second point. I'm then going to take a side shot here just by clicking the measurement button and you're going to see here I've now got two points which represent the um, two points that I've shot here, the two points that I'm going to use in this setup. Now what I'm going to do is because I want to rotate points two and three to be at zero degrees for my setup, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the plumb bob icon and then click on calculations and scroll to the bottom here where rotate translate scale is. I'm then going to apply user find parameters here and I'm going to do a rotation. So I'm going to put base point one, so where my total station is sitting, that is going to be the point around which I want to rotate. And then I'm going to do a direction difference setup here. So my original direction is going to be between points two and three. So to get that direction, all I need to do is type in two dot dot three and you're going to see here I get a nice angle readout which is the angle between those two points. And then my destination direction I want to have as that zero degrees as I said at the beginning of the video. So I'm gonna leave that at zero degrees. Once I have that selected here, I'm gonna click on adjust points. That's going to allow me to do this translation and then I need to choose the point range over which I'm doing this. Since I wanna rotate all the points in my job and I'm rota rotating around point one, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put in one and then dash three to get all the points that I currently have in my job. And it's gonna say three points processed and now I need to redo my back site and you can see points two and three have rotated about 90 degrees to be on that zero degree bearing. And now if I do my back sight again by one, um, one point here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set my instrument height to 1.5 meters again, the exact same setup. And then my back sight point, I'm gonna set to point three here. And now I'm ready to begin serving. All I need to do is click measure to save my back sight and I have finished what I need to do for this setup. And I'd like to thank you for watching today's video. It really does help us out if you hit that subscribe button down below. It lets me keep making these videos and keep producing some more things for the channel. And if you have any questions about anything in today's video or any questions about anything you've seen on our YouTube channel, please give us a call at 1-888-286-3204 or visit us on the web at bench-mark.ca.